Today, I am going to walk you through a complete step-by-step -step guide to fix the download issue in Escape from Tarkov, where the launcher shows the message user action required and unable to download the file. If your download keeps stopping, refusing to begin, or instantly throws this error, stay with me because I will show you multiple working methods. These steps are simple, safe, and designed to fix the problem completely. Let us get started. Before we begin fixing the issue, here is what causes this specific error. The Escape from Tarkov launcher sometimes struggles to connect to content delivery servers, especially in regions where the route to their servers is unstable. This leads to forced download pauses, incomplete packets, and ultimately the user action required error. Knowing this helps us understand why the fix works. Method 1. Stabilize the network route. The first fix is the simplest, and it works for most players. Step 1. Open your web browser and download ProtonVPN or any reliable free VPN service. This is important because when you connect through a VPN, your download route changes to a stable global server, which bypasses the faulty region-based connection. Step 2. Install the VPN and connect to any location that offers a high-quality route such as the Netherlands, United Kingdom, Germany, or United States. Step 3. Open the Escape from Tarkov launcher and start the download again. If the error appears, press the retry button repeatedly for a few seconds. For many players, the download starts normally after a few retries and continues without stopping. If this does not fix the issue, move to the next method. Method 2. Clear Battlestate game cache completely. The launcher stores temporary files in three different Windows app data directories. If any of these files become corrupted, the download will break instantly. Here is how to clear everything safely. Step 1. Right-click on the Start menu and select Run. Step 2. Type the command. Percent local app data percent and press enter. Step three. Inside the app data folder, you will see three subfolders named local, local low, and roaming. You must open each of these folders one by one. Step four. Inside each folder, press the B key to jump to files beginning with B. Look for a folder named Battlestate Games. Step five. Right click the Battlestate Games folder and delete it. Do this inside local, local low, and roaming. These are only cache folders, and deleting them forces the launcher to rebuild everything fresh. Once you delete them, open the launcher again and begin the download. If the issue still continues, move to the advanced fix. Method 3. Apply the TCP Auto-Tuning Network Fix. This fix stabilizes your Windows network handling and prevents data packet drops during large downloads. You only need to apply this temporarily while downloading Escape from Tarkov. Step 1. Click Start. Type CMD. Right-click Command Prompt and choose Run as Administrator. Step 2. In the Command window, type exactly the following. Netshit TCP set global auto-tuning level equals disabled. Press Enter. This command disables a Windows network feature that sometimes conflicts with game launchers and disrupts downloads. Step 3. Close the CMD window and start the download again. In most cases, the download will now begin and continue without interruption. Revert the network setting after the download. Once the game finishes downloading, you should restore the default Windows network tuning. This is how to do it. Open CMD again as administrator and type. Netshit TCP set global auto tuning level equals normal. Press enter. Your network is now back to its original state. After the download completes, open escape from Tarkov and confirm the launcher no longer shows the previous error. At this point, the problem should be completely resolved. This was a complete and detailed guide to fix the escape from Tarkov launcher error user action required unable to download the file. Each method in this video is tested and proven to work for different situations. If this guide helped you, make sure to stay connected because I will continue posting more reliable and easy to follow fixes for PC games and Windows issues. Thank you for watching.